students i am getting a lot of frantic calls these days students are scared they say sir we don't know what to do what if we don't get selected this year i want to address this point in this video i want to tell you that you have to take out the fear of failure from your head the toxic thing at this stage of your preparation toxic thing at this stage of your preparation are fear overthinking and pressure of perfection fear means you are worrying what will happen in uh, on the exam day i want to tell you it is possible that none of the question in neat exam is from weak areas think about it like this be positive don't worry about the exam it is possible it is very well possible don't overthink what will happen whether i'll be ready uh, uh, do i have the capability to crack such a big exam don't overthink and don't waste time on trying to perfect things don't get into pressure of perfection focus on syllabus completion focus on your mock test don't worry about whether you have done a lot of questions out of digestion and absorption no it is not going to help just focus on syllabus completion and your mock test so these two things you have understood have this positive attitude think that it is possible none of the question is going to be from your weak areas everything is going to be what you know in the neat exam think about it like this and keep things simple and just focus on two things keep things simple and just focus on two things 10 to 12 hours of studies daily imagine this the amount of time that is remaining in neat exam you can easily study around 1100 hours 1100 hours this is a lot of time why because Total need preparation, total need preparation is of 2500 hours, 2500 hours and you can still study 1100 hours. So don't worry about, you have not started till now, you have finished only 25, 30 chapters, you have finished 60 chapters, doesn't matter. As soon as you fix up these two things, 10 to 12 hours of studies daily, and you are setting micro targets for 14 days, five step preparation. I've explained it again and again. Let me tell you again what this five step preparation is. You decide what date you are going to write the mock test. Simple. Before that, you will complete the syllabus of the mock test. After that, you are going to revise for the mock test. By the way, mock test coming up, 14th March, 11th syllabus, which means 50 chapters. You have to do 35 to 40 hours of revision. You have to do 35 to 40 hours of revision. Otherwise, you will forget a lot of things in the mock test. This is what I'm talking about, right? But if you're not writing this mock test, you are writing some other mock test syllabus as rest, you can give less time to revision. After mock test, fourth step, do your post-mortem, find out what your weak areas are and fifth step is, fix these weak areas before your next mock test. Just keep this thing simple, 10 to 12 hours of studies daily and under a micro target. This is your micro target of 14 days, these are the five steps you have to do and you have to keep repeating them till neat exam and you'll be okay. I'm telling you students, don't think in terms of what if you don't get selected this year you can still you can still start not get selected this year but you will get selected next year but start now even if you have not started at all a lot of students i i salute these students a lot of students are joining our full course some are joining our uh, single subject course right some people are joining our short duration revision course but the thing is, short duration revision course or crash course, right? Even if you don't join any of these things, just follow these two simple things. Just follow these two uh, simple things. Don't overthink. Don't complicate in your head. Don't get confused. Don't fear anything. Don't be afraid about anything. Just focus on whether you are studying 10 to 12 hours daily and whether you are following a plan, whether you have set a micro target and whether you are going to write a mock test. Just do these simple things. You still have a lot of time available. Don't worry about the result. It doesn't matter whether you will get selected or not. 
what is in your control is you are studying daily you are giving your time to prepare for your mock test you are writing mock test you are identifying your weak areas you are fixing your weak areas and forget about everything else and you'll be okay so please understand it is very important you don't develop lack of confidence you should be confident about yourself you should not fear anything and everything is going to be all right if you still have any questions ask me in the comment section but keep working hard don't give up because at the end of the day if you are working hard everything is going to be well all right students